Hey guys, Celinda here from Mama Tried. Today I want to do a little declutter, but before we get started on that, I really wanted to talk to you about something that truly, truly helped me in, in my housekeeping journey, in decluttering, in really simplifying my life. And it is 15 minutes to me. It's just the timer is magical. It gives me a hard stop. It gives me, when I'm in the right mood, something to compete against. And it also diminishes the, the monumentalness of sometimes um, my projects can feel like to me. And so today I'm gonna take you into the master bathroom. It is ugly. I don't, I don't know what else to tell you. It is, it is ugly, it is ugly, it is ugly. But ugly and cluttered it never helped anyone. And I do have some big design plans on that and those are gonna come in the fall. But um, I'm feeling a little overwhelmed at the state of the bathroom and you're going to get in there and be like, why, Celinda? Because it just, it feels like it's on my head, like I know it's going to be there. So I'm going to grab a trash bag um, and we're going to set the timer for 15 minutes and I'm going to get done what I can. And I hope that you will set your timer while I'm doing this and you will tackle something. I don't care if it's a tabletop. I don't care if it's your junk drawer. I don't care if it's a one, your spice cabinet. Let's take 15 minutes. Let's knock it out. Let's go. Okay, here's my plain Jane bathroom. There it is. And what we're going to work on is the cabinets down below. And not because there's a ton out on my counter, but clutter begets clutter. I fixed a little hole, left the spackle right there. Like, what's in my head? And I just... I feel like when I open up my cabinets, I can't get exactly what I'm looking for. So let's get started. Okay, let's open it up. All right, this, this guy is helpful, but also my nemesis. I just can't seem to keep it clean. I'm gonna be brutal with my stuff right now. I, I have to be. It's been sitting there forever. Okay, uh, eyeshadow keeping, base keep. This I'm gonna let go of. A friend of mine um, was getting rid of it and I thought because it was a name brand that I should definitely have it and it would make my skin glow but it doesn't and I just keep it now because it has the name on it like I didn't even spend money on it so hand lotion I'm letting it go because it has been opened it's halfway used but I'm not really a hand lotion girl I I want to be it smells good but I am not lip liner again 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 with what I want to be <laughs> I'm, I'm not in a phase where I lip line my lips. Someday I may get there, but I doubt it's gonna be there with this. And this I did actually get from um, taking a, uh, watching a makeup artist on YouTube, and she would put it here in the corners of her eyes to help combat that sunken eye, but I never use it. So, goodbye. This is a lid to something, I don't know what. I don't even know what half this stuff is. I don't, I can't read it. Yep. So these are all going, and this one's going because it's broken and uh, it keeps dumping um, chunks of eyeshadow on there. So again, all done. This I never use again. So now it's down to this, my makeup brushes. And my morning and evening face cream. Like, I'm embarrassed with how easy that was and how much I turned it off and we're only at two minutes. How much I put it off. Next, I bought hair clips. We are bringing those claw clips back. 
Do y'all remember those back in the day? Oh, and the banana clips. Ooh, don't get me started on the banana clips. Um, I did see an image where they're coming back. So that magic is gonna start up again and that's gonna be something. I'm gonna go ahead and take them off of this display thing because I won't use them when I have to in the morning when I'm getting ready for work if I have to undo that. So I'm gonna undo that. It's the dumb stuff like that that we put off that then we find we're not using our stuff. We never took it out of the package. Do you ever just get disappointed in yourself? It's happening, I'm getting feelings. overnight bag from the um, unpacking from our big vacation, which I'm sure you all were riveted to your channel for, and my sink suds. This guy I'm going to give away. I'm going to empty out the um, hair bands and bobby uh, pins that are in there, and I'm just going to get rid of this. I've had it for a year. I, I don't use it. It goes donate kind of bummed because I just took a load to donation. My extra loofah for when my other one is ready to be replaced. They were in pack. And this overnight bag. Now I'm struggling. This is this is the first run-in, so I have two overnight bags and I am one person. And the thought would be to keep them both, but I keep going back to why. Well, what would be the significance of keeping both of these? Would I use two bags of makeup? We've already established how small my makeup uh, collection is. And I can't think of a reason. So I'm actually gonna let this one go as well. Uh, empty can. What? Again, what the fuck? Why? These should be going in our medicine cabinet. Makeup remover, baby oil, and mousse. Am I the only person who still uses mousse these days? I don't know. What is that? know but I obviously am not using it if I don't know what it is and an extra thing of soap I'm getting rid of that paint your state because why wouldn't you have that with your makeup curlers are done and I'm going to clean out this drawer I'm gonna let you see it that's like my hair supply drawer. I have an elastics bin, some broken elastics, my two combs, bobby pins. I will never use this attachment on my dryer. Be willing to break up the set if you don't use it. out at the amount of hair in here it's kind of making me dry heave but I'm a brave girl So brave, I'm so brave, I'm so brave.
Y'all, I gotta hang up with hair. Woo! Just do it, just do it. I'm so brave. All right, that took whew, three minutes, but I am sweating. I don't like hair. Come, my bobby pins, my elastics, and the perfume in here. Okay, what was that? A minute? Done. Done. And I knew I had to do this for literally months. Months. This whole video, if I do not an ounce of editing, will be eight minutes long. Eight minutes. And and I put it off and I I made it this big thing. I just I just get so irritated with myself sometimes. Do you ever feel that way? Do you like honestly what that was in my head? I'm going to sneak a peek in my husband's drawer, but I have learned a painful lesson of decluttering. Don't touch your loved one's stuff. If they're not ready to let it go, you touching it has not helped them. In fact, did anyone um, used to watch that show, Hoarders? Was that what it's called, the Hoarders? And um, when families intervened, uh, they would do an update like six months later and the hoarder had acquired everything back because they weren't ready to let go of it. They didn't have a reason to. It was just the family stepping in. Of course, they loved a clean house. Who doesn't? But they hadn't dealt with the issues of, of decluttering themselves. So I do not touch. But if I do see something in here that's empty or, or something, I'll go ahead since I'm up here and get rid of it. I actually am going to organize this for him. I'm not going to get rid of anything, but... You see what's going on in there? It's just a mass of clutter, and I'm just going to reorganize it for him. Some of those floss things have fallen out into here. I'm gonna put them up. I actually do have a jar for them to sit up right on the counter, so I'm gonna grab those. Don't look at my butt. Okay, so I couldn't salvage as much as of them as I thought because something spilled in here. And that's the thing about clutter. I, I'm sure neither of us, I'm sure neither of us had any idea anything had spilled in there. We wouldn't have left it. So now I have to clean that out real quick. But even now, the timer is still going and it's still only 12 minutes. This portion is proving to be a little difficult. I'm gonna to have to soak it, which will put us well past our 15 minutes, but um, give me a second to keep scrubbing this and we're going to get this done because now I'm in it to win it. Okay. So even that I thought was going to, well, like when I first looked in and saw it, it did occur to me and maybe go, oh, edit that part out so that I just don't even deal with it. But it, it took me a minute and it's all clean. I, I constantly, I'm in awe of why I procrastinate. Just putting his soaps back in. His soaps. I act like I don't wash. Our soap. Let me see. That's all. I'm not going to mess with that. Like, that's like his day to day. 
So the only thing I got rid of out of his drawer that what I would constitute as his drawer is this empty razor case and the, the Jags uh, flossers. So everything else that was in there, I put back in. And since I'm looking at it, I'm gonna spray down these cabinets and wipe down because why not even though these gold I mean I know you're jealous okay so I'm gonna go put the painters tape away this and I do have a donation bin I'm going to drop those in my donation box Okay, so let me show you. In here, we organized and cleaned out. I cut, I got at least 10 or 15 things out of there. My to-go's and my extra clips are in there. I'm actually now thinking I should probably put them in my hair bin because it's where I put my stuff to do my hair, so it seems legit, so let me do that. Okay, even better. Now all of my hair supplies are right here. And all of my makeup remover is off to the side over here. And my um, packing stuff, my hair drawer, and my husband's uh, semi junk drawer was not earth shattering. In fact, my night would have gone on and been fine if I hadn't, but I knew this had to be done and that weighed on me. And I feel even though my bathroom is not what I wish it would be, it is clean and organized. And I know that when I start my work week tomorrow, it will be ready for me. And that makes a huge difference. So again, I would encourage you to set that timer, do that power of 15, and let's continue to declutter and decorate and make our homes beautiful. Well, guys, that summed up the 15 minutes. If you're feeling inspired, give that 15 minutes a try. Thanks for watching. Bye.